Holy and blessed Jesus Christ, the perfect radiance of the eternal Heavenly Father, who enlightens us with joy. As dusk draws in upon us and the evening lights appear, we sing our praise-filled hymns to God, the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Son of God, you deserve that every age joyfully sing your praise, for you give life, and so all the world gives to you its glory. Yet as we come to the end of this day, we acknowledge our need of forgiveness. And so we unite in saying, Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed, and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your Spirit, and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. With the confidence that our requests are answered, we say, Calm me, O Lord, as you still of the storm. Still me, O Lord, keep me from harm. Let all the tumult within me cease. Enfold us, Lord, within your peace. Before we sleep, we long to hear from God in his word, and tonight we listen to Jeremiah 57, verses 20 to 21. There we read, those who act wickedly are like the surging sea that cannot quieten itself. Peace is impossible to those who do evil, for this is God's verdict on them. We all know the reality of which Jeremiah speaks, but we know too the rest that remains to the people of God when they quieten themselves before him and his Christ. Lord God, the tempests of our world surround us. Wickedness often flourishes on every side, our hearts too often beat to that of the world. Grant us then your peace, that peace which only you can give, as we place our trust in the Lord Jesus. I will lie down this night with God, and God will lie down with me. I will lie down this night with Christ, and Christ will lie down with me. I will lie down this night with the Spirit, and the Spirit will lie down with me. God and Christ and the Spirit be lying down with me. Thus, May the peace of all peace be ours tonight and every night. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen.